Hello and welcome to the Art of Cooking. I'm Raymond and I'm going to show you how to make vegetable lo mein today. Of course you can add shrimp, beef, chicken, roast pork, basically any kind of meat you like. You can also add eggs in there which tastes very good. But for this one I'm just going to do basic vegetable lo mein. I don't want to overwhelm you with all these ingredients. So let's get started. Here are the ingredients you'll need. So the first ingredients of course you'll need is lo mein noodles. Lo mein noodles are usually made out of wheat flour, cornstarch, water, and eggs. So here I have 1 pound or 0.45 kilograms of lo mein noodles. In a pot of boiling water, add a pinch of salt and then add in the noodles. Cook it at medium high heat. Make sure to occasionally stir it. Cook for about 8 to 9 minutes. After about 8 to 9 minutes of cooking, take the noodles out and cool it in running water or ice water. This stops the noodles from cooking any further. Next, put in 1 tablespoon of vegetable oil. Thoroughly mix it. The oil prevents it from sticking together. After cooking, the lo mein becomes 2.2 pounds or 1 kilogram. Now that's done, let's prepare the sauce. First thing you'll need is 2 green onion roots, mince. This is my way of mincing green onion roots. Run your knife at 45 degrees angle and cut it, but don't cut it all the way. Turn 180 degrees and do the same. Now you want your knife perpendicular to it and cut it like you would normally cut it. You should have about 1 tablespoon minced green onions. Next, peel the ginger skin off using the back of a spoon or a knife. Mince about 1 tablespoon of ginger. Transfer the minced green onion and the ginger into the bowl. Next add 8 teaspoons of soy sauce, 6 teaspoons of sugar, 1 teaspoon of dark mushroom flavored soy sauce, 6 teaspoons of cooking wine, 5 teaspoons of oyster sauce, 1 teaspoon of sesame oil, a little bit of white pepper or a couple dashes. Next, let's prepare the vegetables. You can use any vegetables you like, just make sure they're drilling strips. And the amount of vegetable is up to you, but I recommend a 3-1 ratio of a lo mein to vegetables. Here are the vegetables that I am going to use. I have some napa, bean sprout, bamboo shoots, and the julienne, carrot, and celery that we cut before. I'm only going to use a fourth of this, about 0.5 pounds or 0.22 kilograms. Next, in a pot of boiling water, put in the lo mein noodles. Cook for about 10 to 15 seconds, then remove it. Set it aside, do it right before you cook your vegetables.
Turn your burner to high. You want your wok or pan to be very hot. The heat will prevent the noodles from sticking. It also reduces the cooking time for the noodles. Put in some vegetable oil and coat your wok or pan. Remove the excess oil but leave about 1 tablespoon of oil in there. Add in 1 tablespoon of minced garlic with fire off. Then add your julienne stripped vegetables and turn the fire on to high. Cook the vegetables for about 20 to 30 seconds. After 20 to 30 seconds, add in your noodles. Make sure the noodles are still wet and not dry. It's best to drain the noodles when you are cooking the vegetables. The excess water will prevent the noodles from drying. Cook the noodles for about 30 to 40 seconds. Add in about 4 to 5 tablespoons of the sauce and mix. Make sure to spread the sauce around, don't pour it in in one spot. Now continue to cook for 20 seconds or so. In my case, the cooking time is about 1 minute to 1 minute and 30 seconds. Your cooking time may vary, so it may take 2 to 3 minutes or so. Make sure to taste your noodles before you add in more sauce. The more sauce you put in, the stronger the flavor. Likewise, less sauce less flavor. Now we're going to start the plating process. Oh yeah, for the regular viewers, if you realize that the voice sounds a bit different, Ray got a bit lazy, so I'm just filling in, and my name is Stan. Thank you Stan for helping me out. I'm not lazy by the way. So, who wants to eat lo mein? Sorry, you can't have any, but you're welcome to make it yourself, now that you know the recipe and you know how to cook. Oh, by the way, the lo mein should look like this. Just look at the color. Mmm, you want some? So, if you like this video, please subscribe, fave, like, or comment, and share. Thank you for watching, and I hope you like this tutorial.